Wow, it's snowing. Ugh. Don't you like snow? Snow means it's too cold for rain. Besides, I thought it was supposed to come down in flakes. You know, each one unique and all that. These just look like the ends of Q-tips. Haven't you ever seen snow fall before? I'm sure I have. On TV. <laughs> I'll see you at lunch, okay? Hello. My name is Edith Cullen. I didn't have a chance to introduce myself last week. You must be Beau Swan. Uh, how, how do you know my name? <laughs> oh, I think everyone knows your name. The whole town's been waiting for you to arrive. Well, no, I... I meant, why did you call me Bo? Do you prefer Beaufort? Absolutely not. But I think my dad must call me that behind my back. That's what everyone here seems to know me as. Oh. Okay, everyone. Lab today. The slides in the boxes in front of you are out of order. I want you to work together to separate the slides of onion root tip cells into the phases of mitosis, something you should be well versed in, so you shouldn't need your books. I'll be around in 20 minutes to see who has it right. Get started. Lady's first partner? Uh, sure. Go ahead. Proface. Did you want to check? Um, no. No, I'm, I'm good. <coughs> Did you get contacts? No. Oh, I thought there was something different about your eyes. Are you enjoying the weather? Not really. You don't like the cold. Or the wet. Forks must be a difficult place for you to live in. You have no idea. Why did you come here then? It's complicated. I think I can keep up. My mother got remarried. That doesn't sound so complex. When did that happen? Last September. And you don't like him? No, Phil is fine. A little young, maybe. But he's a good guy. Why didn't you stay with them? Phil travels most of the time. He plays ball for a living. Have I heard of him? Probably not. He doesn't play well. Just minor league. He moves around a lot. And your mother sent you here so that she could travel with him? No, she didn't. I sent myself. I don't understand. Well, she stayed with me at first, but she missed him. It made her unhappy. So, I decided it was time to spend some quality time with Charlie. But now you're unhappy. And? That doesn't sound fair. <laughs> Haven't you heard? Life isn't fair. I believe I have heard that somewhere before. So, that's it. You put on a good show, but I'd be willing to bet you're suffering more than you let anyone see. I repeat. And? I don't entirely understand you. That's all. Why would you want to? That's a very good question. I'm, I'm sorry. Did I... Am I annoying you? No. If anything, I'm annoyed with myself. Why? Reading people, it usually comes very easy to me, but I can't. I guess I don't know quite what to make of you. Is that funny? <laughs> More unexpected. My mom always calls me her open book. According to her, you can all but read my thoughts printed out across my forehead. I suppose I've gotten overconfident. Um, sorry? Okay, guys. Let's go over these. 